So what's going on guys, it is GM at SB Boxing. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel before you click on 20 of the videos. Also comment below in the comment section if you guys have any opinions of what I'm saying in any of my videos. Like always, it's appreciated if you guys could drop me a quick sub or two on my channel. So, I'm going to make my prediction video for Manny Pacquiao versus Jeff Horn this weekend. Manny Pacquiao will be travelling overseas to Australia to face Jeff Horn in his home country. Jeff Horn is a fight or when this fight was announced people were like what why because they didn't really know who Jeff Horn was me I'm a hardcore boxing fan so I knew who Jeff Horn was but I didn't really know too much about him I've seen a few clips of him online I've seen yeah a couple of clips of him online so I don't really know too much about him I know that he fought Randall Bailey a couple of fights ago, Randall Bailey is a former two-time light like, weight champion and a very hard-hitting fighter and he was a fighter who was relevant um, going on nearly 15 years now, Randall Bailey. He did pick up a world title in 2012 but he quickly lost it to Devon Alexander. But in that fight, Jeff Horn was dropped by Randall Bailey and no doubt about it, Randall Bailey hit very hard and still does by the signs of that Jeff Horn fight and he fought a guy called Ali Funeka as well and was dropped in that fight Jeff Horn so he can be hurt he can be dropped in fights and against Manny Pacquiao he'll really need to try and not get hurt because Manny Pacquiao is very quick and he hits very hard like you won't be able to see them punches coming what Manny Pacquiao hits you with even at the age of 38 39 years old like Jesse Vargas was dropped by Manny Pacquiao in Manny Pacquiao's last fight in the second round. He wasn't particularly hurt, Jesse Vargas. It was a flash knockdown. It was one of them shots. I think he saw it coming, but I don't think he realised the weight on it and he managed to just put him down quickly. But Manny Pacquiao, um, his trainer Freddie Roach is saying that Manny Pacquiao will be looking for the stoppage in this fight against Jeff Horn. And I think if Manny Pacquiao wants to get it, then it's going to be here against Jeff Horn. I've just watched um, Wingy's prediction for this shout out Wingy not of Akira Shanku and all of that and he's talking about Jeff Horn saying that he has very low hands and I agree with that Jeff Horn does have very low hands and against somebody like Manny Pacquiao that could be a problem especially Manny Pacquiao the way he can counter punch and stuff like that he's very quick Manny Pacquiao he throws shots at awkward angles and with low hands against Manny Pacquiao that could be a problem Jeff Horn might just go in there and just go for broke because um, Jeff Horn's trainer is saying that they're trying to get a knockout over Manny Pacquiao so we could go in there and try and have a tear up against Manny Pacquiao but I don't think that will work out well for him if you go in there and try and have a tear up with Manny Pacquiao then you better have some power and Jeff Horn hasn't really got tremendous power don't get me wrong he can hurt guys he has stopped guys he's got 11 knockouts in 16 victories but I just don't see him being able to stop Manny Pacquiao. I see Manny Pacquiao being too quick, um, countering him. And just Manny Pacquiao's footwork and the awkward angles he throws shots at, I think it will be too much for um, Jeff Horn. So I'm going for Manny Pacquiao to win this fight. But I'm not going to say that Manny Pacquiao is going to knock Jeff Horn out. I'm going to pick Manny Pacquiao to win this fight by a wide 12-round unanimous decision, similar to his last fight against Jesse Vargas. I see that fight going similar to that, Manny Pacquiao in control, he might even drop Jeff Horn a couple of times, but I don't see him stopping Jeff Horn, so yeah, I'm going to go with Manny Pacquiao to win the fight by a wide 12 round unanimous decision, but upsets can happen, Jeff Horn might be the real deal, because he is undefeated and he looks like he's on a bit of a run, he's beat some decent opponents like fringe contenders, so... We don't know until he steps up how good he actually is, but I'm just saying Manny Pacquiao would be too much for him, just from the style. So, yeah, comment below in the comment section. It is JM, it is speedboxing.